The Vietnam War was one of the most divisive conflicts in American history. From 1955 to 1975, over 2 million American soldiers served in a war that left deep scars on the nation, on the world, and on the men who fought it. Today, we explore the untold stories of these soldiers, not just as warriors, but as young men who face fear, loss, and the unknown. Hi doll, I don't know who will get home first, me or this letter. It was so good to hear your voice. You don't know how close I've been to getting killed or maimed. I see Jenkins lying there with his brains hanging out, or left you with his eyes shot out. But it's over now. Now it's time to forget. But it's hard to forget these things. Peter Rupka, like many soldiers, found it hard to leave Vietnam behind. His letters home revealed the emotional toll of seeing friends fall in battle. These young men didn't just fight the enemy, they fought their own fears, and their memories would haunt them long after they returned home. For many. Vietnam became a place of routine survival. Days blurred into weeks as soldiers battled the heat, the rain, and the invisible enemy hiding in the dense jungle. But it wasn't just the combat that wore them down. It was the endless waiting, the long nights spent wondering if the next step would be their last. In these moments of quiet, they thought about home, about the life that once seemed certain, now uncertain. The letters they sent back to loved ones were their only anchor to a world that felt so far away. The Tet Offensive in 1968 marked a turning point in the war. American soldiers, many barely out of high school, were thrust into brutal firefights. For every victory, there were losses. And for every step forward, there was another step back. I close my eyes and all I see are the faces of my friends who didn't make it. Jenkins. Lefty. I wonder why it wasn't me. Someone was looking over me, but I don't know how to keep going. It's hard to forget these things. The memories of those battles stayed with them long after they left Vietnam. For many, the war never ended. When they returned home, they were not greeted as heroes. The nation was torn apart by anti-war protests. Many soldiers felt isolated, trapped between a war they couldn't forget and a society they didn't want to remember. The American soldiers who fought in Vietnam were not only fighting an external war, but an internal one. The trauma, the memories, the guilt. These battles raged on inside them long after the last helicopter left Saigon. The next two sentences will be modern day veterinarians reflecting on their experiences in the Vietnam War in interviews. You never really leave Vietnam behind. The things we saw, the things we did, they changed you forever. It wasn't just the war that hurt. Coming home to a country that didn't want us, didn't understand us, that hurt us too. Today, the legacy of the Vietnam War lives on in the hearts of those who survived. It taught us about the cost of war. Not just in life loss, but in the lasting emotional scars that we leave behind. The Vietnam War may have ended nearly 50 years ago, but for the soldiers who fought in, the echoes of that war still remain. The Vietnam War was a military conflict that took place between 1955 and 1975, between the government of South Vietnam, supported by the United States, and the Communist government of North Vietnam. In 1964, the United States became directly involved in the war after a purported attack by the North Vietnamese Army against the U.S. warship. Over the following years, the United States sent troops and resources to South Vietnam to fight against the Communist Army of the North. However, the war resulted in a prolonged and costly battle in which the United States did not achieve a clear victory. The conflict was marked by brutality on both sides and the loss of many lives. In 1973, the Paris Peace Accords ended U.S. intervention in the war and withdrew U.S. troops from Vietnam. However, the war continued until 1975, when the North took Saigon, the capital of South Vietnam, and unified the country under communist rule. The Vietnam War was a turning point in U.S. foreign policy and remains a controversial topic in American history. Although the war ended decades ago, it remains a relevant and studied topic today.